Hello and welcome to SnowRunner News. I'm UK Gamer 88 and I keep you updated with the latest SnowRunner news, new mods for console and new mods for PC. Now if you haven't seen me before then we've been cracking on for a while and I keep you updated in the week time. So what's going on? Nothing from Sabre and Focus, no word from them whatsoever with any dates or anything. We've just got to sit and wait on that. But we have got the first look at the RNG MPV which has just come out for Patreon access. Now, if you want to get on that, then you join Patreon, you can get early access, which that will probably be a few more weeks in testing before it's released, but we'll get on to that shortly. So first off, what have we got? Well, we have PC mods, and what have we got in there today? We have the Gangster Tweaker, which is the first new mod in, and then we have the Denside Classic by Redline Creations. So only two mods for PC today, which is a bit disappointing. But we go over to console and it's looking pretty good for console mods today. And here's today's console mods browser and we have the Glitchworks Custom G3200 and then we have the Crew Cab Trail, Trail Brawler and then the K3K7286. Now that's a beast of a truck. That's back in today and then Olsen's trailer back is there. And also we have a new map, the island, the interior and exterior Tune in for Yansor's MIKZ MIR, and then we also have the F750 upgraded with IR's Gooseneck trailer pack is back. And then yesterday, uh, just after I done the video, we had the Skate Max Pack and the Truck Max Pack came back for console. So we got 309 mods in there now so it's quite a few but you can see it glitches out still on mine where it says 20 mods are loading still that's something to do with the dlcs but that's your lot for today's console mods update now there was another new mod so it's 310 mods in there now which is the new map which is called polygon and that is a test map then if we go over to the console recheck for those who don't know the recheck is anything what needs an update it goes on the recheck to get checked before it goes back into the game and the peterman 3790 is still in there with with rock bottom and we've also got these 67810 slot trailers so that is your lot for console so going over to the ranger workshop and we have on screen the mpv which is new creation what Ranger's been working on this for quite a while. So it's at, at early works in progress, but basically if you want to get your hands on that, you can do for, if you're a Patreon member, then you will get access to that for only on PC, obviously at the moment. But if you want access for that, the Patreon link is in the description and you can go and get your hands on that now. Now he hasn't done all the textures for it. So this is basically basic rolling model and he's done a fantastic job of it so far, but it does need tweaking and his work's in progress. I'll show you how it pans out over the next few weeks because average time normally it's about two to three weeks, but uh, depends how it goes. But nice bit of kit, something new coming, and this will be coming to console and for PC. Now, if you want to stay up to date, then why don't you come and join our 808 modding Discord group? The link for that is in the description, and it's just a private messaging service basically where you can post links and we update you with the latest goings on any info what comes across in the daytime i normally put it in there first and if you're looking for notification for videos then you will get notified every time i do a video i've got the announcements channels there so you won't miss out on all, any of the latest videos as i know that youtube hasn't been playing a very good game on keeping people informed lately but there you go Right, oh, that's it for today's SnowRunner news. SnowRunner new mods for console and new mods for PC. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, I'll see you on the next one. Big thanks for watching.